Hey guys, Professor George Cernak, Team Heads of Grace of Denville. Uh, a lot of times um, I get into a position with a bigger guy, stronger than me, and uh, he has closed guard. How do I open his guard? Um, there's a, a lot of ways that he can control me, so I want to show you one of the ways that I've learned that works very, very effectively uh, to opening the guard of a stronger, bigger person and successfully passing. So we get to this position here. Okay, my partner <clears throat> has his legs closed behind me, all right? So from here, what I'm gonna look to do, guys, is I'm gonna get a grip here on his sleeve here and get a grip here on his collar and make an X, okay? So from here, I'm here, I'm gonna get a grip and then afterwards get a grip. So look, we're hand fighting here. I know which side I want. I'm gonna get his hand, I'm gonna steer it across. Now from here, I'm gonna get a grip and punch this down. So I'm gonna put my pressure here, okay? Now I can safely stand up with my right leg and as a result of me having control of his sleeve, he won't be able to attack my balance with that hand. He'll be able to attack with my other hand but that's not gonna matter so much. So, from here, here's my grips. That allows me to step up. One, two, step up. Keep your legs close to me, All right? Okay, keeps his legs closed. From here, look, I'm pinching my knees together. I'm not leaving my legs open because I don't want him to drop his hips down, his feet right, put his feet, and now take me over. So, cross, step, step, Pinch. So now his hips have to stay high. So now look, I'm gonna go two on one and stretch my partner out and then I'm gonna cross grip here. At this point here, I'm putting my hand on the knee, stepping my leg back and I'm just having him slide right down my knee and I wanna nicely pin this across like a straight jacket here, okay? From here, my weight can go on top, get a grip. I'm gonna look to pin, and now finish in this nice shovel side control position. So one more time. Once I stand up, I want him to keep his legs behind me. I want him to keep his legs closed. So we're here, I know what he wants. I'm gonna hand fight, grip, grip, cross, step, step, pinch. Okay, from here, bring this across. Help it if you want, pressure it down. I'm getting a grip here. And now from here, step through and pass. One more time, let's turn this way here. Okay, from here, break this, cross, step, step. Pinch, two on one, break his posture. From here, I slide them down nice and slow, knee comes through, plant this down. Finish in side control. Okay, so this is a great way we can, uh, we can pass the guard of a bigger, stronger guy, guys with really long legs, guys who don't mind the, uh, the, the gi control and stuff like that because they're so spidery. But when you stand up and then you don't allow them to put the feet in the hips and open up their legs by pinching your knees together and stuff, make sure you remember those details, this will help you control the person. So what I mean is here, okay, I know I'm going over this a little extra, but when I get up to this position here, when I stand here, I pinch my knees together. He's hips can't fall to the ground. If my knees are loose, his hips fall to the ground, his feet come into my hips, and now I'm in all kinds of trouble. So, as I stand here, here, boom, pinch. Now he's riding on top of my knees, boom. All right guys, let's do this right, a lot of details. Great way to get past the big man's guard. Team Manager Gracie Denville, move of the week. Thanks for watching.